This is a video response to Shall Not Be Infringed and uh, his, his video about the Wall Street, Occupy Wall Street. And um, if you haven't seen his video yet, then much like he says occasionally, if you're, if you're sub to me and you watch my stuff regularly, I think you'd be missing out on something if you don't try to watch his stuff regularly. Um, as you know, we tend to do. Well, I don't know, not so much with him, but uh, I tend to make quite a few responses to the stuff he says. Anywho, in his vid, he, he talks about the difference between a guy with a rifle talking of things like revolution and uh, the difference there between that and a cute little co-ed with cornrows weaved in her hair carrying around a flower talking about revolution. A couple things popped into my mind. There's a big huge difference between an ugly man wearing uh, camo with a Gazden flag as a backdrop and a cute little co-ed who's easy on the eyes just running her mouth about stuff that she doesn't really believe anyway. <clears throat> and even if she does believe this at the time, you really think their conviction is as great as a man who's been out of work for 18 months and is mad. <laughs> you know, seeing a bunch of a bunch of folks protesting and protesting on Wall Street and, and doing their little dance. I mean, that's entertaining. A bunch of strong men who are armed with deadly weapons isn't entertaining. It's scary. Nobody wants to see that on the news. It's scary as hell. So, um, you know, they get the pass because they don't really mean it. And they don't really mean it because you're not going to be enacting the type of change that they want without violence. And that's why you got to measure your words. Because it's serious business. If, if something terrible happens, if you don't have systems in place to, to replace it or understand the full consequences of what it is that you're saying, then you're really, one, not only wasting your time, but it could be, it could go from pointless rhetoric to pointless violence. <sighs> so this video sort of spun out. <laughs> Started out so good. Personally, regarding uh, revolution, I I believe that the way that our our republic is is arranged or originally designed, it's almost in a in a constant state of, of revolution, so to speak. Like there's a there's almost no point if you really have a true true American free process, revolution's actually pointless. You know, you just got to get back to to the core framework and allow those things that 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 need to be taken care of in their own way to be taken care of in their own way. And if you need uh, and if you need the government to to equalize things so bad, then by all means move to a place where uh, where they.